Yo, what's up guys, Georgia Dude here, welcome back to another video, it's been a long time since I've done a video, because I'm running out of series, I don't know what I'm going to be doing, but I'm going to, uh, I'm still thinking, alright, but we are back to recording, um, today we're going to be doing another ranking video, and it's going to be about ranking, um, the bosses, um, like ranking of, um, this time, it's gonna be on like how it's gonna be from easiest to hardest, all right? So, um, starting at number wait, uh, what minute is yeah eight? Um, um, it goes to Jahala, the easiest boss. Boss, let me just start it. It goes. Um, he is the easiest boss, of course. Um, all you do is um shoot the mirror shield on him, and yeah. I thought, um, I thought, um, it was a very easy boss, the easiest boss by far, and, um, that's one of the reasons why it dropped, um, dropped down to the very bottom of the ranking list, like, of the original ranking list of boss ranking. Um, it was just too easy and not my cup of tea, um, it was boring, um, it fit, um, the tempo pretty good. Um, but it was quite annoying trying to kill all of them, and it's basically just all of them, and it's just easy overall. The only, like, annoying and a little bit of hard thing is trying to kill them, which is really annoying. Okay, guys, the seventh easiest boss goes to Mogera. The reason why is because he was really easy, and, um, all you do is just grab the tug and then just hit it. Um, you only do that four times. Um, yeah, it's a very easy boss. It's, um, it's just, it's, um, if it wasn't for those little mobs, it, it'd probably be the easiest on my list, guys. But, um, with, um, with those mobs around, it's kind of made this boss a little bit harder. But overall, this was, like, one of the easiest bosses ever. And it's an awesome boss, and it loses a lot of damage. Like, if you get eating, you, it loses a lot of damage from you. It, it loses two hearts. And I think that's the most in this game, honestly. Well, actually, in normal mode, but not in hero mode. Okay, guys, sixth easiest boss goes to Helmarok King. The reason why it goes to Helmarok um, King... Um, well, actually, wait, the sixth easiest... Wait. Um, it goes to the Helmarok King because he was really easy. Um, the only part, um, going up, um, trying to get up to, like, the main stage was a little bit difficult. But overall, it was easy, like, he puts his head in, on, in the ground, and you just hit him with the, um, skull crusher, or hammer, I don't even know what it's called. And, yeah, that's pretty much what you do, and then for the second phase, um... You, um, the shell breaks, well, the armor breaks, and then instead of the hammer, you just, um, um, use the sword to hit it, um, which was a really easy boss, but it was a pretty fine concept, um, my only pro, or, yeah, that's all. Okay, guys, the fourth easiest, I pronounced the other ones wrong, um, I did like 6th easiest, 7th easiest, that was wrong guys, but for the 4th easiest goes to Goma. The reason why this goes for, it, um, well this was the first boss, and the reason why I didn't put it as easiest is because it was actually, um, for a first boss it was quite a difficult boss to be honest, like, the first phase, um, it, it kind of was annoying trying to get the tail, like, it would move around, it wouldn't stay still, um, but it was fun, like, going on the tail, it was like a fun ride, um, you like broke the armor, and then the second phase, if the second phase is real easy, you just get the grappling hook, and you just like, um, you like, um, I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it, but you like, I, I'm not sure, like, you need to like, hit the grap, um, get the hap uh, grappling hook to hit, uh, hit the eye to try to kill the thing. Alright guys, the fifth easiest goes to Color Damos. I'm not even sure how to pronounce the name, but it goes to this beautiful plant. The reason why is because the boss was a little tough um, overall. Like for the second boss, it was actually kind of tough. Like the, um, it was kind of annoying the arms and when you had to hit the plant, like the plant closes too soon. That's like the 
um, like one of the main problems. Like it's like you get stuck in there and you lose a, a full heart, which was really annoying. I made it a little harder. That's why I placed this for like um. That's why I placed this for the fifth hardest, um, fifth easiest, um, aka um, third hardest, or no, fourth hardest. I mean, um, but overall, it was a cool boss and kind of easy a little. Okay, guys, number th um, the third hardest goes to Golden. Um, Go um, Golden. Um, the reason why I did, um, uh, I keep telling you in the videos, guys, I didn't really fight it properly. I didn't fight it wrong. I just didn't fight it properly. Um, but this boss was still pretty hard. Like it was annoying at times. That's why I put this for third artist. And but it was an amazing boss, I must admit. But still, it was actually a real hard boss, to be honest. Um, like um, like sometimes you miss for no reason, and the arms can be annoying sometimes. Like sometimes when you get both arms, it like recharges the arms. Like. I don't know how to say it, but you have to hit it again, like the same arm, and then you can start, like, getting the head, which was pretty annoying at times. Um, but it was actually easier than I thought. Okay, guys, you're probably shocked for I'll uh, put number uh, the second um, hardest. It goes to Ganondorf. And the reason why is because um, you probably would expect this is the hardest, but no, I don't. Like it was hard, I must admit. Well, it wasn't like the um, like uh, it was kind of hard to be honest. Like, uh, but for the Ganondorf fight, it was kind of easy, even though I got hit like a billion times. Uh, but to be honest, it was kind of an easiest boss to over uh, boss overall. Um, and you guys are probably shocked that I put this for the hardest of all. But I really don't think this is the hardest of all. To be honest, like I think this was worthy for the second hardest. To be honest, like th I must admit, this guy is hard, pretty hard. But um, um, uh, it's overall it's easy. Like when you're gonna kill him, it's easy. Okay, guys, for uh, the hardest of all, Puppet Ganon. The reason why it goes to Puppet Ganon... Wait a minute, I hate when this happens, guys. Just wait a minute. Okay, good. Um, The reason why it goes to Puppet Ganon is because this is actually a really hard boss. The first phase um, was the second, um, um, is, the, is in the middle. The spider one is the easiest, but for the last one, like the snake one or the Moldor, I don't even know. Um, it was the hardest, but this was a the Papa Ganon was really hard overall. Three phases, oh my god, you've got to be kidding me, guys. Like, I know there's different kinds of, uh, I don't, I know they're not all, like, Puppet Ganon, but I'm still gonna count it as, like, all Puppet Ganon. Be um, like, it, um, like, this is definitely the hardest boss, guys. It's, um, not, it's, nothing can beat this, not even Ganondorf. Like, literally, this was the hardest one. This, that's, this is what it made it the hard, um, hardest. There you have it, guys. Those that was my boss ranking of from easiest to the hardest. All right, so you probably there was probably some shocking, there was probably expected in it. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and leave a like and tell your friends and families about my channel. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you later. Jojo out. My bad, forgot I pressed the wrong button. Jojo dude.